What's up, guys? It's Dan Camacho here. Another episode I want to bring to you. Now, this episode is going to seem a little strange. I'm not going to be talking necessarily exclusively about cryptocurrency or blockchain or any of the markets or anything like that. I want to talk today about how you find ideas, how you keep up on the news, how you actually find incredible AI technology, how you find alpha on cryptocurrency projects, and so, so much more. It might seem silly, and this video might get some, some hate, but people consistently, constantly ask me, how are you keeping up with the latest trends? How are you finding your news? How are you finding all these different AI tools? How do you know what's you know coming out next, so forth and so on? And to be honest, I, I've always sort of kept up on the news and the the the, the in terms of technology, cryptocurrency. I'm, I'm just very interested in the latest tech and what's the latest and greatest around AI, around marketing, around business, so forth and so on. Um, but you know, as of late, it's all really consolidated into a, into a few very um, small places, I would say. One of those places being Twitter or X, right? Another one of those places being YouTube. The amount of value is massively underrated that you can find on all of these platforms. And the amount of information you can get and the amount of uh, different things and different topics you can learn, it's un unbelievable. It's, it's actually quite insane. And I'm constantly calling my timeline and saving and bookmarking and reposting you know, all kinds of different topics and content so that I can actually have this content at my fingertips. And let me show you what I'm talking about, right? So many of you know, obviously, what X is and what Twitter is and what keeping bookmarks are, right? But I have hundreds of bookmarks, which is information, massive amounts of information about the latest tools for AI, about the latest and greatest, um, you know, alpha on, on cryptocurrency, and so, so much more. I mean, let me let me just show you as an example what I'm talking about. Do not underestimate the value of these tools, right? I mean, literally just today, I bookmarked a few things. And I bookmarked this one from Salma. <coughs> Excuse me. I bookmarked this one from Salma. And let's jump in. What did she say? She says, AI-generated ad creatives aren't just coming. They're already here. Creating high-quality AI creative assets has never been easier. Six must-have resources for generating AI creative assets. And then if you look down here on the side, she'll go through literally different ways of creating ads um, for different products, right? And she'll give you an exact tutorial, how to generate creative ads for products with AI, and you can find out a tutorial. Um, Mid-journey workflow. So there's a workflow on actually how to create products right here you could actually follow. Uh, gives them a mid-journey style reference guide, how to create custom images in mid-journey, right? And she kind of goes through all these different use cases on how to create these different things. And it's just mind blowing how much uh, value you get out of that. Another one from Levels IO, right? Many of you know Levels IO. He's an indie hacker. He's built some awesome software and he's making a ton of money doing it. He posts, my brother Pixel Protest um, reviewed all the AI video models. Let's see here. I want to make this bigger. Okay. He reviewed all the AI video models available in this thread with the same image input so you can compare them. And he literally reviews Kling AI, Pyramid Flow, Cog Video, Stable Diffusion, Runway ML. Uh, Halo, Luma, all the different cutting edge video models that AI is producing. He literally goes through and reviews each one of them and gives you pros and cons for each one. Huge value, right? You can just click into that and very easily understand how AI video works with very, very little effort, right? Um, another one, here's some alpha on crypto. Hold 20 to 100 cat in multiple accounts. What do I know? I know nothing but there will be some decent airdrops for cat holders. So this guy's basically saying, if you hold uh, cat tokens, you might want to put them into different wallets because there will be some airdrops coming to cat token holders. You could take advantage of it, right? That's some alpha that you got. This is all just from today. Yes, I'm making hotellist.com. Is there a perplexity for travel? Okay, there's not. If you know what perplexity is, it's a massively successful search engine that's taking on Google. And this person is asking, has there been one for travel yet? And this guy levels IO says, yeah, I'm making one, right? He lists the, the URL. And there's just so, so much. I mean, here's another one, right? I created a fairy tale using AI some time ago. This week, I decided to use Replit. Uh, agent, Replit AI agent, to build a personalized universal fairy tale generator for kids. Choose name, age, and theme. Receive two bar <coughs> text, and boom, you're there. And it gives you a rundown of how that works. Now, I could go on and on, right? Because these are just literally my bookmarks. So you guys probably all have your own bookmarks. And it's, it's insane, though, how much, again, value you can get off of all of these different things that are happening on Twitter. Here's another thing, right? Finding out all the, the news that's happening in the world, right? Elon Musk last night, he announced all these different innovations from Tesla. He's releasing Optimus, like the new humanoid robots that are coming out. He's introducing RoboVan, which is basically like an autonomous 
uh, van that will take people around the city and drive them in, in driverless cars. He introduced the, uh, what is it? The, it was a taxi, another driverless car. Um, all this stuff you can find out very quickly in real time, right? And it just, it just goes on and on. Here's another one. This is wild. Hey, Jen just dropped Avatar 3.0 and people are going crazy over it. Now you can generate an AI clone of yourself with different poses, outfits, and camera angles. Here's how, and a tutorial on how to do that. Massive amounts of value, guys. So with all of these things that are happening on Twitter, you're on X, you're literally able to create a full company by just like looking at what's happening in the marketplace right now. So I know it's not groundbreaking. I know it's not revolutionary. Many of you all probably do this already, but I can't tell you how many people come to me and say, how do you find all this information? It's very simple, guys. Go to Twitter, go to X, go to YouTube, interact with people, start following the right folks, start learning, start using and start building something badass, all right? I'm Dan, Crypto Camacho. Hope this was useful for you, and I will see you next time.